um, just knocking the earth trip out um, and checked all the solar modules. I mean, that one's blown up there. Look at that. Um, those one system is not used. Um, that one's not used. Only this one that's running for the solar down there. So I've disconnected all them. But the fault was in this box there. So actually, that mark there is a track that was alive there, and it's shorted out between there and that, that screw, um, which I found on a mega. Yeah. I didn't get a video of doing that because his milk was hot, and we were, in a, we were in a bit of a rush to get it cooling again before the tanker comes. But, uh, uh, it's got a bit of damp on there, shorted out, and it's it's sort of carbonised it. Mm. It's got a hot gas um, valve on here, which isn't it's on the system that isn't used, but that would that would dump hot gas into the evaporator through this connection. Put that expansion out there and it dumped hot gas in there so it stopped it freezing the milk. It's quite an old tank, I don't know if it says on the, on the data plate if there's a date on there. It's probably 20 or 30 years old, that's about. 